This is where you check in. And yeah, you know, the rest of the place is kind of cute. We're working on it. Not too bad. Of course, seeing this little jewel in the parking lot should have given me a clue. That was our room. Pretty. Let me take you on a little video tour of the shittiest hotel I have ever stayed in. Looks kind of cute on the outside, but once you get in, you can start to see signs that it's really not in a very nice place. It's just this single door lock, no deadbolt. The lights turn themselves off after time if there's no movement. It does have some beautiful artwork. These are curtains. They are nailed into the wall. There are three different pieces of material. I actually used electrical tape to keep them closed because they don't really do a whole lot of good. That's the view from the bed, which is pretty classy. There's a sink over here in the room for reasons I don't understand with no hot water. Another curtain. They said they're in the midst of remodeling, so maybe we're lucky that we got a refrigerator, a microwave, and a fairly nice TV with some excellent cable routing. Not even attached to the wall, it's, it's literally just hung in there on a piece of molding that's missing over the bathroom door. This is the kitchen table. This is the remote you get when you check in so that you can turn on the air conditioning slash heater. In the bathroom, you've got a nice peephole through the door handle into the bathroom, which is almost the same size as the rest of the room. Here's a mirror for you to look at your balls. Another sink with no hot water. An outlet over nothing. Drain in the middle of the floor. More fabulous curtains. The tenant above you, that's their toilet fire. So you get to hear that flashing light. And again, the light doesn't stay on unless there's movement in the bathroom. I have no idea what the hell that is. It came with this towel, a single towel. Shower looks new, no hot water. Shower curtain doesn't go to the floor. That, I guess, is supposed to keep water from flowing into the bathroom. I was going to take a shower, but there's no hot water, so I guess I'll never know if that actually kept water in the shower or not. I guess it's a sit down only shower. It's just strange, strange little place. The tile here looks new. I'm guessing those are holes in the wall. Transition to old tile with several different colors. There must have been another sink there. Towel holder with no towel. Why do they even bother hanging pictures at all? I guess the door used to close automatically. But no smoking. This place is classy. That concludes our tour. Thanks for watching.